Hello everyone, how are you doing? Long time no see. Um, if you're new, my name is Serena. I used to do a lot more videos because um, I love to share my handbags loves, you know, my love for fashion. Uh, but I haven't been filming a lot because uh, the stupid Hermes game is so hard to get, you know, a handbag. And I feel like, um, all these other purchases from Hermes is really not worth sharing that much unless you know if you guys want me to share like what I purchased lately other than handbag stuff right so but I'm so happy that I got a new handbag today now from Hermes um, as you see from the title it's from the row and it's just so popular and it's a Margo handbag I just really love the look of the bag and then there are different size options let me just open it um, so I just received it from FedEx um, let me open it and um, talk more you know about um, the story I, I was eyeing on it since December like I finally decided oh I want to purchase this and it turns out it's not that easy to get so only from yeah last week um, it became available um, yeah it's just a return they give you the receipt um, a return form packing slip and even a return um, sticker so very nice um, if you're printing anything, oh, sorry. Um, have a tissue paper. Oh, there's no nothing, no other box. Just the um, dust bag. I purchased from the roll uh, official website, so not from other e-commerce. The dust bag has very tiny here. The roll and. <laughs> I hate to waste time for you know all other things, but I just want to show you the back. Ooh, I love it. The leather feels good. <gasps> oh man, love, 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 love this. So the roll Margot. This is size 10, and this is black with silver hardware. <gasps> Look at that. Pretty. Sorry, I had to change to a different location because my <coughs> daughter just came back um, and took over the living room. Grandma is with her. Um, yeah, so I just want to show you some detail of the bag. This is a Margo 10. So that means this width is 10 inches. Oh, I just love the look of it. How pretty. It's a very minimalist design and with just two buckles on the side. I believe they have 10, 12, 15, 17. And of course, everybody loves are the bigger size bags, but I don't use big bags like on a day to day basis. And whenever I use a big bag, it's more for work or travel. And I have my Goyard tote and I have a Chanel Deauville tote. Um, so I don't need another, you know, giant big bag even for styling you know so get all the stuffing out the interior is a canvas coated um light color so you can see your stuff very easily and there is a slip pocket on this side and the bottom has four feet um mine is the papo leather which I think is more scratch resistant and the smooth leather is actually more expensive and of course prone to scratches a lot, lot more um, oh my god this leather it's soft and feels very good quality luxurious I mean I've seen all the good leather from Hermes um, Chanel is a different story because it's caviar or lambskin but I mean for a good calf skin this is good and the stitchings and everything are very are perfect oh by the way the pebble leather comes with a silver hardware and the smooth leather comes with um, gold hardware lately I've been loving silver hardware a lot so I you know with no-brainer this is cheaper more durable super happy about it and here is the shoulder strap that you can clip 
on you know the inside i don't intend to wear this as a shoulder handbag so it's more of like a handheld handbag and you know it i think the size is similar to birkin 25 i no longer have my um nata birkin 25 with me i sold it um to fashion file um because i have my nata um constance 18 which i use a lot and i just don't feel like having expensive hermes handbag of the same color so if i ever come across another birkin 25 in a different color i would happily you know still buy it but um yeah i just don't want to have nada anymore um yeah my dream birkin 25 at this point is a e-tube with silver hardware so we'll see if i can get it eventually here is the roll label all around you don't see any branding it's very low-key just the design oh i love it i haven't been excited for a nana herbes coda bag for the longest time and this is the bag i feel like brings back my handbag love you know for different designs and this is soft it does have enforced bottom so i don't foresee things you know make this bag sagging so let me put my stuff in see how it goes a um key holder six ring my wallet my um hand sanitizer hand cream and my lipstick and i can actually pop a really big sunglass in if i need to see um and my phone phone is the pro max um yeah everything fit in very well um you know and i can totally feel a lot more and it's it's a good size you know everyday handbag even a water bottle if i need to can get that in as well so but it's getting heavy with a water bottle get that out first so let me show you how it looks like on me margo 10 size on the side and I love the handle is bigger than a Birkin 25 that I can put it on at the crook of my arm. <sighs> love it. Love. Love it. Casual, everyday handbag. Loving it. I'm so excited. So that's a quick unboxing and uh, my first impression quality great size perfect and it has a shoulder strap just in case i don't want to carry it um handheld i can pop it um crossbody so that's it for my new handbag love it thank you thank you for watching today's video and if you have any questions or you want me to do a more in-depth review just let me know down in the comment section and i will see you in my next video bye